We're back, people, and today we're going to film on Keaton Mitchell, Baltimore Ravens running back, rookie, finally getting his touches these last couple games, and he's been so explosive. Every time he gets the ball, he's just like a big play waiting to happen, and I feel like that's exactly what the Ravens needed at the running back position. Really good compliment to Gus Edwards out there, and I think he's going to help take this offense to the next level. Really exciting player to watch. I think he could potentially be a super like a future star just like the explosiveness I feel like he's pretty nuanced with his running like he's very efficient understands how to press up into the hole make his cuts with good timing and everything like that also good vision like he sees the field very well and then even though he's a smaller back I think he plays with some pretty good toughness and contact balance for a guy of his size uh running this draw here sees this space open up presses up into his box and then look at a lot of the guys with a little less nuance would press like to the outside here a little bit too early and this guy would make a tackle but since he presses up here an extra step it gets this guy to come inside far enough and now he has the speed to change direction and burst to get to the outside and now he's just faster than everyone else on the field a big play <laughs> he's been absolutely dynamic for this Ravens offense really really excited to see how the rest of the season plays out for him good run from Mitchell here 11 yard gain his runs are actually so interesting like it's either like eight yards at least or a huge gain or he's had like some negative four yard runs very hit or miss right now but it's a mostly hit which is still insane love his patient love his footwork love his like body lean naturally forward like this like this is like exactly what you look for with your running back when it comes to like their natural pad level leverage movement skills things like this press up make a very efficient like wide base point the toe this is exactly the lower body you want to see fluid hips stick that foot in the ground get up vertically everything super fluid all his feet his moves are tied together like he took that right from the ground and he's already sticking the left foot to the ground maximize his yardage run into some tackles bounce off people you can see that low center of gravity physical physicality he can work up through like he sometimes tries to go for the big plays a little too much but he's also can just run through between the tackles because he has that play strength element to his game nice little nine yard gain here for Mitchell he's we've seen him run on some draws but it's also a uh, he's been pretty effective in the gap scheme things whether they're running like power or counter he's very good at working off the back of the pullers he understands exactly his responsibility and just getting skinny through the hole here I like just no wasted movement we've seen him try to do a little too much at times I think on certain plays but you can just see get downhill be decisive follow the back of your blocks things are blocked up get skinny through the hole, protect the ball, don't try to t dance around, do anything too crazy, just burst through, get low, and like, he gets skinny right through there, this guy has a chance to get a hit on him, possibly make this like a four or five yard gain, but he gets through it and you know, picks up nine on the play, really like these efficient runs from Mitchell too, because he can hit the big play, but also have the nice quality solid runs that you know, you need your running back to have. Another example of Mitchell picking up a nice run, love this when a defensive tackle comes in unblocked because sometimes you know things get blocked up really well you have a lot of space to work with but it's not always going to be like that you got to be able to create on your own this guy gets into the backfield very quickly he's supposed to work off the back of these guys and he makes this guy miss in right as he gets the ball basically makes him miss which is very impressive then get to where you're supposed to burst through the hole pick up some yards very very good love running backs that can create plays when things aren't blocked up perfectly very impressed with this five yard run from Mitchell. The gap scheme stuff, following your pullers, patient, set it up, get downfield, like love a patient run. We've seen him be decisive and just hit the hole, but here he needs to be patient, allow his blocks to develop, allow them to get set up here. Cause if he tries to, you know, shoot up through, none of these guys are engaged yet, all three of these with these three defenders, but he says patience, allows them to get engaged. And then he sticks up in the ground, gets upfield, anticipate that, that land to get skinny, get through that hole, then change direction, cut this back, pick up just five yards on a solid run that could have easily been, you know, one to two if he got a little impatient, but this is very good running back play, working through the trash as well, good efficient footwork, he's very active with his feet, look, look at the little hop steps he's taking, like it's very quick, choppy, and he's always ready to just make a move, and then he can like, he can hit with the quick cho choppy steps, but he can also stick that foot outside the frame and make a hard cut and just get upfield very quickly love his athletic ability overall he's just a big play waiting to happen he will hit a hole and he's gone he has that burst to combine it with the long speed he'll break a tackle at the line of scrimmage this is the stuff that you love to see this edge defender gets a hand on him love the dip of his shoulder here like 
this guy has a chance to make a play on him he dips that shoulder to reduce his surface area make this guy have no chance to get like a clean hit and then he just gets skinny makes himself smaller harder player to hit and now once he works through that he doesn't slow down through that contact at all and has the speed to get to the end zone love that run from Cade Mitchell he's just a huge huge playmaker I think Mitchell can also make a nice little impact in the receiving game get him the ball down in the flat set him up in space on screens there's nothing too crazy about this type of play I mean you can just see the burst and speed out in the open field doesn't you know do a whole bunch of like create there's just a lot of space to work with he's not doing anything super special but it's just nice to see them get him involved like this you can see that he uh, can definitely make an impact in this area of the game last play that we're going down here for mitchell just another big run versus the seahawks very very impressed with this getting in the ball out in space break a tackle the contact balance then you know burst make a guy miss out in space elusiveness very quick feet look at that natural body lean it's all just so impressive we can see you know from the end zone view here love this style of play just get him the ball in space press up to the outside then get down, stick that foot in the ground, break a tackle of the DB. Gets uh, He does a good job with his low center of gravity, bracing for this contact, staying square. He's always staying square too, which is a big part of making like efficient cuts, making guys miss. That's a big part of running back play. Get to the next level, make that guy miss with a quality cut. 27, turn him around, pick up some extra yards there. Runs a little bit out of gas at the end, but he is a huge, huge big time playability running back these are guys are so important these scat backs that you know what they'll be called but on limited touches it doesn't matter if you're making big plays like this you could be a potential star in this league and i really like the potential that mitchell has on the ravens he's gonna be a big time playmaker for them and i think the ravens got to steal with him i made a video on him coming out of the draft which i was a big fan of his game and he's been even better than i expected so if you guys are the video make sure to like come subscribe i'll see you guys next time peace